I told you, I, I a fucking wrap that motherfucker around my balls so they look a little bandana just to puff my fucking balls out because I had hey, I had issues. Have you seen the picture? You know the funny thing is, the bandana you're wearing, I have put around my balls. Okay. I have a picture of it, it smells, somewhere. It smells like <laughs> dude. I I thought I thought you were just eating some uh, huevos rancheros, and now I'm over here. It's actual huevos. It's actual fucking ball sweat on my head. Yeah, it's okay though, cause my ball sweat smells like bubble gum. That's Mine smells like peanut butter. I have juice and maple bubble gum. syrup. Actually, mine I smells like I, maple syrup. It doesn't blow the full bubble. It just pops the tongue out like a booty crack. Yeah, pops the tongue out like a booty crack. You know how they work. Dude, Allie, for one, Allie, absolute sweetheart, and uh, she would never, ever, 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 ever do anything. Why? Uh, that that would be looked down upon in the history of the world. She's just, she's absolutely she perfect. So, next time you say she's gonna be do, banging dudes around the corner, I'm sorry, you're you're obviously wrong. Oh. All right. She'd have like a nice plush bed to do it on. There'd be no corner. Oh. Did I go down on Joe? No, I'm. I have bad knees. Working on the the oh, truth shall set you free. Oh. The truth, is, truth is, my friend. Sponsored by ICDC College. I could die today. I could die today, and be hey, a happy that's, man. That's so. Like, well, I don't know about that. It, Anybody could die at any yeah, time, and I know that for a fact. Well, I'm saying, if you died today, would you be a happy man? I could die today uh, and be happy with what I've done with my yes. life. Yes. I mean, yes. I planted a seed on this I, earth. I I've lived a hell of a life. I'm saying, man. It's like there's certain things in the world that you need to do before you go, and I feel like I've done enough of them that if I went, I'd be cool. Ooh, I don't know about putting, that, putting though. Putting a kid out there? I'm still young. It's like this. You you want to live forever, right? Nah, just but till who, 70. Who, just till 70. 70? <laughs> I hey, I don't want to be in this chair before. forever. I'm <laughs> saying. Well, you, who, by the time you're 70, they might have advances where you got, like, a mech suit. Where you're, like, robot warrior, android, ass warrior. I, I, I don't have high blood pressure or diabetes. I am Mr. Random. I went to the doctor two weeks right ago. From the past. To take over the dead Mr. Random. Doctor said to me, he was like, he was like, Billy, you are, you are such being for your size. You, you, there's no reason how you can exist in such a healthy state and be your size. He offered me six. He offered me six grand to do an overnight medical study, and I was like, "Nah, man, I'm not trying to give my secrets up. I don't want. I don't want the rest of the fat people in the world living forever. It's gonna be hard enough being a hundred years old and fat. If I have to compete with other five hundred pound, hundred year old people, that's gonna be hard. What's up, Frankie Car? Bow to the place to be. No more ribs. Um, ribs. Uh, That's ribs. nice you're eating. Uh-huh. Winning! Sponsored by Trojan. Oh shit, my bad. Well, today is officially my last day of my summer semester. I got a B in my speech class, but we're getting turned up. Right, Shelly? I just started with some redhead. Some redhead for now. I had a bottle somewhere. I probably tossed it. I probably drank it all. Fuck. I'm the worst alcoholic. Uh, I got pretty faded the other night. Oh, I can't oh, oh, lie. Oh. I wasn't as faded as Too High, though. Too High was coming with some good trolls, but he was kind of being obnoxious dazed. I, I almost punched him. I almost punched him. I didn't get a... I didn't get a kick it with too high, too close. Everybody. Fire. Oh, that's gone. I killed the fireball. 
What's up, Gracie? Woo! Are you farming? Hey, BTF. Y'all ready to, um... Are you out there farming? See me skin a... No, I just killed a rattlesnake. I'm gonna, I'm gonna skin it for dinner tonight. Are you gonna cook kebabs? Like, how do you, how do you cook a rattlesnake? I'm gonna cook mine on the grill or you know, on the fireplace. Yeah, I'm just gonna bury or dig a hoe and bury the hat. Now, well, how do you flavor a rattlesnake when you cook it? Is there like a sauce that goes with it? I don't know. I watched a couple websites and they didn't tell me. So I'm just gonna put salt and pepper on it. Grill it like a, a, I imagine like a, a steak. A sour. A sweet and thai sauce might be good, like a, a, a spiced Thai sauce. Might be pretty delicious on snake. Salt and pepper goes with just about everything, you know. Uh, you could you could get some uh some sort of umami flavoring. That might be good on the snake. Give it that. Give it that sweet uh taste. Yes, that vaginal taste. No fish. There's a couple of virgins on. Okay, okay. What's up, now? Two and one. Okay, okay, I'll I'll give it up. I'll give up my virginity. Said these battle cam virgins don't want to give it up. I'll give it up. Whoever wants to fuck me, battlecam.com. I'll scream it out while you fuck me. It's okay. Let's do it. Let's do it. You want if you want to meet a virgin, all you have to do is go to a Christian prayer class and find the the one that's not popular. Because all the popular Christian girls are giving it up like crazy. The unpopular one? So is ChristianMingle.com? They, they haven't been taken up on it yet. ChristianMingle.com is for Christian whores who fucking... <laughs> want so I should get up on that. Who, oh, dude, if you want sluts, go to church and find the popular girls in church because they're banging everybody. They're dude, sucking there's, seed out of the fucking... They don't give a shit. There's not a lot of popular girls at my church. I guess my church is doing pretty good then. <laughs> that's that's very holy. <laughs> Infamous one. Why do you think I would uh, the girls would humiliate me? For one, I'm super charming. Like if you've never seen me interact with a woman, then you're seriously missing out. Because if I had a dating show and it was me interacting with women, it would be like me breaking hearts. It'd be yes. thirty minutes of me breaking hearts. So that's that's uh that's crazy. You never... think I'd be humiliated? The one, oh, the one that I buy beer for? The underage one? Buying beer for kids? <laughs> Hell yeah. You kids, you gotta, if, you, if, you, if you're ever gonna buy alcohol for kids, Sponsor gotta make sure to get them. Okay. Oh. Thanks, Mom. I used to drink that when I was a kid. Alcohol. It's really sweet. It tastes like, it tastes like Kool-Aid. If you're a hardcore kid alcoholic, you move your way up to like MD 2020. You know, you go from St. Boone or. It's from Jameson, all the way. I'm talking about for kids. If kids are going to get drunk, they have to work their way up. Sorry about the music. I'm, just, I'm going outside. This is bluegrass that I was listening to. No, I'm a hypnotist. I'm a professional hypnotist. Hold on, who uh? So y'all ready to see me skin a snake? Who's up on them? It's my first time. Someone's up on some nipples. I sucked on some nipples. Are we talking about nipples sucking right now? I want to talk about this. I want to talk about this. Talk about nipples sucking. I was I was Jonah Hill standing in the movie Grandma's Boy. When he was sucking those titties. Yeah, you were good. He you didn't had a want blast with you guys. So yeah, no me. problem, Harry. I cut my hair short. It was short, good to see you. I, I was a little disappointed that you didn't introduce like yourself to everybody home. else. And you stand in all the time in Hollywood. <laughs> oh, yeah, I felt like it was our thing, you know? Like, the, those in the know knew. Huh? Those of us who knew, we yeah, knew. We don't, have so to, we don't have to share Harry. No, 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 no. The little boy, he was dressed as a clown on the red carpet. Did you guys recognize him?